So ever since I was young, I've always been good at getting a chance or an opportunity. Whether it was getting backstage at a concert or getting the free room upgrade at a hotel or being bumped up to business class or helping my band get booked before we got signed. You can watch more details there linked below or even in high school for example being part of both the teen republicans and the young democrats or gosh even talking my way into the opportunity to the first date with my wife you know some would call it a strong bs game but that kind of implies that maybe I'm utilizing things like lying or deceit. But really, I think it's worked precisely because I'm coming from a place of just being genuine and being bold enough to ask. I say it's always worked, but that's not what this story is about. This story is about Wanda. You see, Wanda was the ultimate gatekeeper. Here's the background. So at the uh, Agent 2021 conference, I'll throw a link there so you can learn more about that. <clears throat> Brian Hanley, Joey Giangola, and I all three misread the conference schedule and subsequently completely basically missed out on the live taping of Ask a Gary V. On the Ask Gary V show. So when we discovered that, we were like frantic. We're like, oh man, we're like. There's still 20 or 25 minutes left, so we had a choice. Do we just kind of go and chill somewhere until the next round of sessions start, or do we just kind of march up there and try to get in? Now, at this point, the only obstacle we thought we had was, are they gonna let us in while it's being taped live? Mm, I don't really know, we can, you know, we'll see. The folks that we had talked to um, at Vayner Experience when we agreed to be speakers, said that as a speaker, we'd have access to all of the VIP stuff and, and we'd be able to go to these live tapings and everything, which is really like an extreme bonus. And we're like, yes, that's gonna be awesome. So again, at this point, we're gonna go there. We're just gonna, you know, be like, okay, well, and we'll open the door at the right time and kind of come in, we promise we're not. So we ride up the elevator, we get off the elevator and immediately we notice this guy and a couple other people just being turned away. One of the guys I immediately recognize as uh, another speaker. He was on the insurance side, I think he was like a real estate speaker, but I recognized him. I kind of gave Joey and Ryan the kind of like, hey guys, I got this. Don't worry, I'll, I'll, let me work the match. So I walk up to this lovely lady. She greets us with the sweetest smile and asks, how can she help us? So I dive right in. Gently, using her name and, hey Wanda, you know, here's the deal. We completely misread the schedule. We were out on the field listening to the keynote that I didn't really care for and didn't pay attention to, that guy. Um, and we noticed that we still have a couple minutes left for the Ask Gary V taping, so we wanted to just kind of ease on in. <clears throat> we're not gonna make any extra noise. We're not gonna get you in trouble. You know, again, we're, uh, we're speaking and, um, it's not a problem. We'll make sure, you know, we'll be, is that okay? The whole time she's still got that same genuine smile. She's listening to every single word that I say. She's not interrupting me. She's not cutting me off. So at this point I'm thinking, we're golden. We're in the clear. We are about to go into the live Gary V taping. This is gonna be cool. I can't wait to tell everybody about it. I'm here in front of the two guys that I look up to. I'm showing them the skills. And Wanda looks at me, smiles and says, no problem. All I need to do is see your gold bracelet. Paging Mr. Herman. Mr. Herman, you have a telephone call at the front desk. Looking around, I don't have him my... Oh, you mean, oh, you mean this one? Yes, yes, ma'am. It says, uh, fearless, I just dive in. No, 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 honey. I need to see the gold bracelet that you would have to get into the VIP thing. No problem. You know, we were told that as speakers, we'd be able to get in there. You know, we talked to XYZ from Vayner Experience. They assured us that we'd be able to, even when we checked in, they told us that we'd be able to uh, attend the taping. Again, Wanda has this way of just listening and then telling me, essentially, no, sorry, I'm not letting you in there. <laughs> she says, listen, I understand completely. 
But unfortunately, I cannot let you in there unless you're wearing one of those gold bracelets. And she just stands her ground in the sweetest way. At this point, I'm completely devastated. We're not gonna be able to get in there and see this live Q&A, Gary V taping, and just be kind of part of that and be in the crowd. Heck, maybe even ask a question. And in here, I just utilized my skills and wanted to completely shut me down in front of Ryan and Joey. I'm kind of like, oh my gosh, have I lost my mojo? But even though I was denied, and I mean, denied. When I say Wanda like stood her ground, it was amazing. So that's, that was just incredible. We were all just like, wow, how, like, she didn't buckle at all. But somehow what amazed me was that she was able to like tell us no in a way that still felt like nice and empathetic. Wanda, I think is probably like one of the best moms ever. I'm sure this skill, however, drives her kids just absolute crazy because she is able to deliver that no message in a way that still makes you feel good somehow. Wanda needs to write a book. I wanna hire Wanda. I can't wait to hire Wanda someday. I want her outside of the door, keeping people, keeping scruffy looking indie rock musician insurance agents um, out of the live taping of Ask Woody Wednesday. You know, I mean, I think she needs to write a book on customer experience because let's face it, even in business, but gosh, even in parenthood, we don't always have a yes answer to deliver. We have to deliver a no in some way, uh, some bad news or whatever. And I think, <laughs> I just wanna hang out with Wanda. I gotta learn the ways. When it was hilarious because I tried my darndest and I still got shut down. So Wanda, I hope someday, somehow, you see this video and seriously, write a book, please hit me up I, I wanna I will fly back to Miami just to get you on this vlog and interview you um, it was, it was